little bit and welcome back to Global Swim Building. We're today we are heading up and right back down to Armstrong. I forgot for a second where we were going, but we're going to Armstrong in this beautiful sunset with this gorgeous looking god race with a teeny tiny rocket. No. I've built a giant rocket, so I was like, let's build a really small one. So here it is. In fact, it's so small that it can launch from the top of the VAB. That's some, that's some great shit right there. And you might be noticing some new plumes, some good looking plumes. Well, that's because I sold cryo engines because I was just bored from the regular old engines that I've been playing for so long now. And since I realized that Kerbal Space Program isn't getting any new updates. I mean, I realized that a long, long time ago, but... I always hoped for a bigger engine in stock Kerbal Space Program. Like, 5 meter one. Since 5 meter points are a thing now, but whatever. It didn't come. But yeah. So I installed new engine mods, which still don't have 5 meter part variants. Which is frustrating, but at least we have more powerful single belt, single engines instead of 1.3 thousand kilonewton K1 engine, KE1 engine, aka the F1 engine. We have something more powerful, maybe I, I, if I remember correctly, there's an engine which is like 2000 kilonewtons. I don't know, I don't know. I basically got this engine and got this mod. I was like, hmm, let's build something and go somewhere exciting. And I was like, let's go down from. We haven't gone there in a while. And let's do it with teeny tiny rocket because why not? Armstrong is small. We can build small things to go to small places. If you get what I mean. <laughs> ah, bad jokes. I mean, dirty jokes. Yeah, so. Yeah, uh, we are going to, uh, we're, we got our encounter with Armstrong, there we go, god damn, I can't fucking speak. I wonder when I'm, when am I gonna be able to speak, like, when will I learn to English? I mean, it's not really the point of English, actually, I mean, I'm, I'm like that in real life as well, just can't speak at all, and also, I just, figured out something that my room is cold and for the past few videos I've been sitting like this not moving much which gets away from the actual energy that I have because my pants aren't all over the place even though my legs are shaking under the desk because it's cold but also because I'm excited to do this kind of stuff but yeah, so this video, by the way, for the record, is being recorded at, when is it, December 11th, 2021. God damn, we're December 2021. When the fuck did 2021 end? When the fuck did 2020 end? Wait, it's been two years since Corona is out. Covid is out. Kind of. Anyone else feels like who is feeling like that 2021 didn't happen at all because it was so similar to 2020 that it was it could have been just the same year. I mean, yeah, it happened a lot of things. To be honest, I had some fun memories from the last two years. But most important, I was just here sitting in my room playing video games. Let's face it. A lot of us are doing the same thing. But yeah, what I think? Yeah, it's December 11th. This video is being recorded the 7th, December 11th. Eh? And I hope that this video is gonna go live on. Let me see when it's Tuesday. So, okay. Tuesday is 14th. I hope it's gonna go live on 14th, but if it doesn't, 
I'm sorry. I did everything that I could to make it go live. But yeah. Time, man. Time is really just a pass, isn't it? But yeah. So we landed on Armstrong while I was done. I was doing whatever the fuck. We landed on Armstrong. We got all the signs that we needed, that we could have got. To be honest. I mean, to, to let's face it. Uh, we don't need to get any more signs from Armstrong because we. This was one of the first planets that I visit. Moons. And here I am, again, kind of uh, making some space fans their hardcore space fans, being like, getting them angry, being like, it's not a fucking planet, it's a moon. <coughs> I agree, it's a moon, but also instant death, I guess. Instant karma. I almost died. <laughs> Choking on my saliva, mate. So, yeah. I got an encounter with even Ash. Which I don't even want to, but yeah. I, I don't understand why Ash has such an amazing, such a big gravity well. Wait, gravity well? Can we call that? Gravity well? Why not? Yeah, that's we're coming towards the end of the mission, and I was like, I woke up and I chose violence, so I'm gonna come into the atmosphere so fucking fast that it's gonna be fire and fire all over the place. With the sentence that I just said right now, and the thing that I'm thinking right now, are really not. Binding together. Shit's really fucking dirty in my mind right now. But we're not gonna talk about that. We're not gonna talk about that. So, we've done our re entry. Even we ascended from the atmosphere and we descended again. Which is always good to have. It doesn't matter actually, but yeah, whatever. And now we're landing with this teeny tiny capsule that it can hold only a single person. Also, fun fact, this is the smallest capsule in the game and the lightest. So, yeah, here we go. We landed on the surface of Roth. We're back home, everybody. And, yeah. Well, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed If you did, please love it up. Please subscribe if you're new. And, as always, I hope see you next week. Until then, have an awesome week.